No way. Plant based. No way that's plant based, bro. They, that's cap. This is fire. <laughs> What it is, what it do, what it does, what it is, what it was. You heard? Come on, chill out. What? Today we're doing a spur of the moment video. We are gonna do a mukbang style conversation. We'll figure out the topic in just a minute. We're at this place are called. We, we doing a conversation or are we doing like a review of the food? Both. So we are at this place that has been super. Where, where are at? We are at. We are at a place in Charlotte. Come on. Now. Come on. That has Come on. been hyped lately. It's called Romeo's Vegan Burgers. Everything is vegan, obviously. They have milkshakes. They got chili cheese fries. They got burger. I'm gonna put some of their pictures up right now as I'm saying what they have. I think I'm cool on the milkshake. They got, but it's vegan, so it's not gonna make your stomach hurt. I'm straight. Vegan milkshakes, chili cheese fries, burgers, fries. Probably got a carry hot dog somewhere in the mix. I'm good on that as well. So we're about to try it out for dinner. It's our baby free night. We about to dive in. So we up. Ooh, so yeah, let's get into this food. Stay with us. So we just got our food order and got our buzzer. We are number 14. The first time I tried to eat at this place, the line was down the street and around the corner. Not so real talk, my client was in my chair today telling me that it really wasn't a wait anymore. And then once I finished doing her hair, she actually came here. Shout out to my client, Leslie. And then she let us know that it was no wait again. So I was like, okay, this is the perfect time to try it. Cause who was about to wait in a long line after being on our feet all day? Not us. I know people that waited in that line before and they said they it was at least like an hour 45 minutes and we just got to the front and realized that the burgers are what is it impossible yes. or beyond the meat burgers so we thought it was I, I was thinking it was or we were thinking that they like made their own concoction of a burger yes but it's really them just slapping a patty on the grill you know, maybe they season it sometime. Who knows? We're yeah, going to see. Yeah, true. We're going to see Let's what they do. We, you know what I mean? But just Five from that, we were kind of like, we was like, eh. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's kind of like, eh. Can we make it at home? Like, you know <laughs> what I'm saying? But we're going to see. Because they got a lot of hype on them for a reason. A lot. And people would be dead and they shit like, oh, it's just a Beyond the Meat or Impossible if it wasn't good. Because right. vegan people could go get their own Impossible Burgers. Right. But we'll see. 100% fat. If Alani was here, she'd say, Hi, boys! Hi, boys! I haven't recorded her doing that yet. Wait till y'all see how she how she reacts to buses. It's so funny because we're now those parents that talk about the dumb shit that they, like it sounds dumb, but to us it's so entertaining. But like before we were parents, people was like, yeah, when my kids see a bus, we'd be like, what the f***? I don't give up. I don't even care. And now we, now we realize. Now it's like, when my baby see a bus, all right, we'll be back. Gonna get our food. Still talking about my nails, cause talk to me, nice. Oh no 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 no! They Boss. gave us the wrong buzzer. 
knock off one star for that. I do not love it here. No. <laughs> Fuck. Nah, it's all good. It's all good. I was too excited. It's all good. So Nate expressed that he does not understand what the song Indigo is about. If you know what Indigo is about, let us know in the comments below. That's not a fluttering angle. So we're about to take a listen so we can see if we But we're can not going to listen to it on here. Yeah, no. Yeah, so we're going to get back to y'all. We'll be right back. Y'all already know the vibes. We'll be right back. So I think he was saying I dream in indigo because that's the color he said he was seeing, like purple light. And then you got to think about moonlight. He was saying that she was already at the crib waiting for him when he left the club. So he's saying he's seeing the indigo light shining on her. So that makes him dream in indigo because he can't stop thinking about her. And so the song starts out, he flexing. Should I pull up? Look at my neck. Yeah, so that's his, that's his life to the public. Like, I'm flexing. I'm outside. We at the club. But really, he said what they don't know is you already at the crib. That's really what he want to focus the song on is how he feeling about Shorty. But he can't do that because he got to flex for the people. But he already got what he wanted at the crib. He not even flexing to bring nothing home. She already there. And then you get there, and that's all he talking about for the rest of the song. I guess, I guess that's a good explanation, because I'm going to listen to it again. Like, y'all, I'm a real music head. Like, I don't just... So am I. Don't just no, cut me. Dang. I'm a real music head. I didn't... Y'all see I'm going to stick beside him. That's crazy. Anyways... Nah, um, I, I I really really listen to listen to music and love music. Like I I try to like dissect lyrics. I try to make sense of why lyrics go with a certain beat or why why a beat sounds so well with the lyrics. Like I be thinking about it like that. So I was listening to the song and I'm like, yo, what is he really talking about? Like, so I guess that's what we just did. And wifey, you know, what I mean? you, you broke it down. How you be breaking it down? You know what I'm saying. So I'm gonna listen to it again because I really want to really tap into that joint and try to understand where he went with the lyrics on that joint because the song is a banger. He said, "I so. still believe that we don't die. Feel like I know you in my other life, but when I'm with you, I'm in That's K and Danica's song. I wonder what they think. Y'all, do me a favor. Each send me a voice memo saying what you think. <gasps> ah! Our timer went off. Lucky number seven. Sorry, friends. I'm filming and talking to y'all at the same time. But send me a voice memo explaining what you think the song Indigo means. Because me and Nate just interpreted it on our vlog. And I was saying that that's y'all song. So what do y'all think it means? Okay, let me know in the comments below. Bye. <laughs> yes, yeah, Siski. Oh, we. And they put the sprinkles in the milkshake. Oh, with the, the oh, we in the milkshake. I clearly got a taste. When I used to drink oh, milkshakes, we. that was my thing. Not sprinkles in it, but like. You got the strawberry lemonade. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. All right, so. Oh. This personal thing where I don't like to eat um, anything that my hands have to touch without actually washing my hands. So this is weird, but it's fine. You some wipes right there. I don't. So you just just uh, eat them. the burger with your uh, yeah wrapped around the paper. Yeah. I'm gonna piss myself off when I'm editing this. Like, girl, get the camera stuff. You can tell the fries are cooked in light. Something vegan. Not, yeah, not regular oil. Uh, Lord, please bless the food that we're about to receive for the and strength of our bodies. Bless hands that could prepare and say did take anything that may be harmful or cause sickness. Thank you for this time. And we thank you again. Amen. Alright, moving my burger. What's wrong? They got special sauce on the burger. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
get into it, get into it, get into it. They put tomato on it. Is there tomato on yours? Oh, sorry. It's not. It's yours. It's all good. I told him no tomato on mine. But oh, so here. Yeah, you're fine. I, I'm good with tomato. So y'all saw that. She showed y'all that. Mm -hmm. They got the special sauce, the cheese, the tomato, the lettuce. All right, here we go. Yeah, they are. There's some ketchup in there, too. Cheese. Cheese. I think I gotta get it. Yeah. Let me get another. It's very good. I thought after the first bite that my burger had a little aftertaste. I don't want to taste your grill or your pan on my food. Right. So I do have a little hint of that, but other than that, this See, is me, I don't mind it. I like that. I like that. Charred. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? But this is, this is good. Yeah. Aside from that, the way that put the crispy on the outside is burger will make you feel like you eating a beef burger at a fast food place nah, all flat, over again. Flat. Mm hmm 100% fat. But um, it's not worth an hour and a half or more wait. No. Not even an hour, honestly. No. I agree. But they are good. This, it is good. I'm not don't I'm not taking that away. Like, this one is good, but like I said, I heard people waiting an hour and a half. One of my clients told me, and this was not too long ago, that he went and he waited two hours in line. I said, yeah, you must not have nothing to do at all. Like, That's what I be thinking. It's people that ain't got nothing to do but wait. But all in all, I'm giving it. I do wish I had a crunchy piece of lettuce. That'll make the burger hit even more. I'm sorry, all in all, you give me what? I'm giving it a. I'm giving it a solid eight and a half. Only because I feel like it was a little overhyped. Yeah. Yeah, I give it eight, eight and a half, too. Sorry, my hand was getting a little limp. It was definitely worth the drive up here. Mm hmm. To have something to eat for dinner. I definitely can taste, I don't feel, you know how like, when you eat a burger or a chicken sandwich or something, like even halfway through you start feeling stuff. Mm -hmm. I don't feel none of that right now. So mm -hmm. I, I like that a lot. That's exactly what my client said. She said, I didn't feel heavy and nasty after I ate it and that's what I really liked about it. And the vegan cheese tastes like cheese. Mm -hmm. Like I just remembered the fact that it's not cheese. Could you tell off that? This joint is good. You see now why they're able to do a regular burger? I mean, a right, like Impossible or Beyond Meat? Because I didn't think about this point that they could just get not the patties, but just the meat itself and like season it themselves and form, form the patties themselves. They could be doing it like that. Mm hmm. So, this joint is good though. Sure. I don't no. know how. Um, no, go ahead. <laughs> no, go ahead. I'm gonna say this real quick, then you can go. I know we dumb quiet, but that's just because we eat. Right. I was just gonna say I don't know how people mukbang and do topics because when I'm like, even if I go out to eat with a friend, I'm telling my piece before the food come because once the food come, don't talk to me or. You can talk to me because I'm going to say, mm-hmm, 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 word, word, word. Nah, she really is going to do that, though. <laughs> but I can't do no storytelling, no venting, no nothing while I'm eating. Like, having to stop and talk while I'm chewing is an inconvenience. So, 
just know that between Nate and Bree, the Thread Life will never be a mukbang channel. Because when we get to our food, we're getting to our food. We don't even care about these drinks sitting right here. We're getting to the food. The it's most, about the food. The most mukbang you're going to get is this, right? That's it. Nope. It's all love. Y'all know we got love for y'all. It's about this right now. So, I'm going to finish effing up my food. And when we try our drinks, I'll be back. How about that? That's a good idea. Yeah. Okay. Set, set, set. We back. All right. Now, wifey has, we have demolished, as y'all can see. Y'all see hers right there. Mine is Goodbye. But now, we got the, oh, oh, oh. I need to wash that down. Whatever. Nah, that was fire though. But look, we got this strawberry lemonade and this strawberry milkshake. We, it's about to go down. Some yeah. ASMR action. Wait, it's not Can't really hear that. <laughs> All right, let's get it. Let's see how it tastes. You go first. You gotta get a little more than that. You gotta get a little more than that. There we go. Uh oh, no reaction, guys. I'm getting that shit at the bottom. I don't Stuff at the bottom for the kids watching. <laughs> it tastes like a milkshake. Alright, let me taste this. It's thick. It tastes like a protein shake. It tastes like a protein shake. This shit is fire! <laughs> Oh my god, that joint is crazy. That's gonna be the opening clip right there. <laughs> Ooh, I'm not gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie to you. Do it. I ain't gonna lie to you. I don't matter. <laughs> Alright, let me taste that milkshake. And you taste the uh the lemonade. That's good. You're gonna wanna finish that. It's uh, you know me, after a while no. it's like enough. But that's good. <laughs> Head ass. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> I knew you was gonna like it. Ain't no way. No way. Plant based. No way that's plant based, buddy. Yeah. That's cap. <laughs> cap. That's all. There's no way that's. Nah. They bugging. They saying anything. <laughs> I gotta see the ingredient list. I gotta see the ingredient list. That's crazy. Fire, right? That joint is dumb good. Did you taste the lemonade? Taste the lemonade. Tell me how much. Why is it so warm? They don't put ice in it. I think they make it fresh, so. <laughs> it's, too, it's, warm. it's warm. It's warm. It is warm. Y'all, excuse my beard. It's growing back out, so I've just been letting it rock. This joint look a little crazy. Barbers be like, because I don't see anything wrong with your beard. Uh -huh. But, um, what'd you think, babe? What'd you think? I would get Romeo's again. I'm not waiting for Romeo's. I ain't gonna hold you, Romeo, Romeo. I ain't gonna wait now. But we would, we would get it again for sure. Yeah. 100% we'd get it again. Would recommend. Is it worth the money? My combo was 13. My milkshake was 7. Nate's combo was also 13. And then... The drink is like $4, 4 or $5. So it counts like $38 and change. So me, the way I see it, is food trucks are a little different than your stop in restaurant in what way i don't know i just feel like the grind and the hustle is a little different so you kind of gotta respect they're running a full restaurant from a truck yeah and when you got a hype like theirs and you got hundreds of people in line you kind of that, that's that's work that's a fact you, and you got, you know what I mean? You probably got four or five people working. As opposed to a restaurant, you'll probably have 25 people working. Good you know what I'm saying? So you got, I, when I see that, it's like, and on top of that, they black on So, if I'm not mistaken. They are. Okay. Um, you want the rest of these fries? So, the way I see it, no, I'm good. You go to Chick-fil-A, buy a meal, it's going to be 12 bucks. 
You know what I'm saying? So. Well, you be getting a Chick Fil A. You no, know, if you like me, I go to Chick Fil A. I get the 12 count nugget, and normally I large my joint for the large drink oh, and yeah. fries. So that normally comes up to like 12 or close to 13 dollars. So it's like if I can give them that, why can't I give? Why shouldn't I give my people that? Like, okay. and they trying to build something, and I I want to say they bought this Dairy Queen. So I'm feeling like they. Oh, this about to be their spot. I was yeah. wondering what it was given. Like, why were they right here? Oh, cause this was just Dairy Queen not long right. ago. They just shut they this just down. They just shut this down. Right. Fire. So. Okay. okay. After a long time too. So I'm. Yeah, I'm, this is a. And staple. I'm. I'm not sure, but they possibly because they're they post up here. Work. But yeah, all in all. Show them the building. Yeah, this is this is this the was a dairy building. Queen. This used to be a Dairy Queen. It was here in Charlotte for years. Like it was a big deal when they like shut this OG joint down. Dairy like, Queen. Like people's grandparents was coming here right. <laughs> when they were younger, like so. But yeah, all in all, I'm giving Romeo. All in all, after I tasted the milkshake and the strawberry lemonade, I'm giving them a solid nine uh -oh. out of ten. Uh -oh. I'm giving them a nine out of ten. A nine uh, out of let me, ten. Let me taste this again. Nah, that that milkshake crazy. I'm not gonna lie, that milkshake is stupid. Yeah. It's foolish. Yeah, man. That's it for the visit to Romeo's. Mm-hmm. Um, thank y'all for tuning in as always. You know what I'm saying? How you feeling? I'm happy. And I don't feel I feel great. Like yes. I don't feel like oh I wanna just go lay down. Like Yep, I got some I feel energy good. Like me. is this are we concluding? This is it. We are about this to go. This is the conclusion. Home. We're about to go home, and relax. We both gotta be up early in the morning. Yet again. It's grind time. Grind yeah, y'all know. But one Stylish day, if y'all keep watching these videos, how y'all watching these videos. You know what I'm saying? Videos, we'll be tapped in with y'all. We're going to be spending you know all our time with y'all. We ain't going to have to go to the shops. You know what I'm saying? We'll be able to, you know, give y'all even more content. More quality. More, more time. Quality, it more won't take time, me 10 days you know what to I'm get saying? this So y'all keep tapping in with us. Keep tapping in with us. You know what I'm saying? Like, Manifest support the happen. movement. You know what I mean? Like, <clears throat> there's a lot of time and effort that goes into these these videos and you know she holds down a lot of it i need to start getting more into the whole editing part but she's you know what i mean she kills it y'all so like and on top of that like us being entrepreneurs parents brothers and sisters you know what i mean like whoa they win that's that same um group of kids that we be seeing right yeah Hey, they could be doing a lot worse. They could be doing way worse things than riding bikes. But we tapping out, y'all. We love y'all. Stay tuned for the next video. We yeah. are about to go to Florida, so we're going to have packing videos, hauling videos, vacationing videos. I'm probably going to split the Florida vlog into one of three parts because we're going to be there for a whole week. So it's going to be a, week, a good amount of content to film. Books first. Disney trip, her second airplane ride. So we got some things coming up and in the works and we hope y'all stay locked in because we're getting out what y'all asked for. Lock in, lock in. Oh, no, 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 I ain't even gonna say nothing. Sick. Oh yeah. No, I'm gonna wait. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. But lock in with us, y'all. Appreciate y'all. Thank y'all so much. You know what I'm saying? We tapping out from myself, my wife, and Alani, who is not with us currently, but here, at, <laughs> in our minds, always, all I think about is her being back there, like, bye, guys. Bye, guys. Bye, she, guys. Look, she saw the camera, she said, hi, guys. I'm like, we're not recording, but yes, you little vlogger. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> She's so, ready to do it. But yeah, y'all, thank y'all so much again for tapping into the Threat Set, the Threat Life channel. And y'all are the Threat Set, so. Y'all be blessed, be safe, stay away from negativity, keep yeah. positivity ahead of you. Hear you. And yeah, man, let's and keep And if you ever get down, don't stay down because we ain't got time for negative energy around you. Hey. You heard. We out of here.